G'day guys, how are you going? Um, about four or five months ago, I got a call uh, to a, um, a doctor's surgery, said there was a hot water system that was leaking inside a cupboard. Now that sort of the cupboard was built around the hot water system, so very difficult to get out. We'd have to dismantle part of the cupboard to get out, um, to get it out and stuff. So um, I suggested to um, the, the secretary on the desk, well maybe we should um, put it outside. So the owner, of the owner of the actual building came down to meet with me. I said, look, with the age of water system stuff, I think the best is to put it outside, get it out, get your cupboard space back. Um, if there's any issues in it later on, it's not going to flood your, you know, your, your office and your carpets and stuff. And he said there was a car park outside. I said, yeah, we can put it up on brackets. And I showed him where it was all going to work. And so I gave him a price. No worries. And about three or four days later, I hadn't heard back from him. So I just called him up. I said, hey, um, how'd you go? Did you get it sorted? Or, you know, just a call, seeing how, how, how it all went. And uh, he said, oh, no, we've got it sorted. Mate, you know, um, mate, mate of mine, um, yeah, I, I, I gave it to him because you know, he's a bit cheaper than you. I was like, okay, no worries, thanks uh, for, for letting us know. Anyway, um, I was working at the property next door, um, fixing a tap over there, and I thought I'd come past and just have a look and see how it all got sorted out and stuff. Um, yeah, and so here it is, just, uh, you know, they, they put up on brackets nicely, just like I, I had suggested and stuff. So, you know, really, you can see the plumber's done a really neat job. Um, just a little thing like this. Uh, how the clips are on in line, that's a, that's a nice nice thing to do if you can. But a few things, like this is a, the pressure relief valve that needs to be pulled every six months. So when you pull those, um, water comes out down the bottom. Now, that water is meant to spill into a grate. Yeah, the, you know, Australian standards said you can't have it on concrete because apparently it gets slippery. So what, what I was going to um, do is bring the copper pipes all the way along and down and there's a, there's a drain right here. Just pop it into that drain. That was, that was part of it. Also, the, um, in Australian standards, this here has to have insulation around the whole thing. It all needs to be insulated. This pipe, also the temp valve there, that needs to be insulated. And the whole rest of it. Now, even this, even this um, what they've used here, is um, it's not self-sealing. No, they've just cut the normal stuff and put duct tape around, which is not going not gonna to last um, forever. So, anyway, a bit, I was a bit disappointed I didn't get the job. And you can see now, it's like, well, okay. I was a bit more expensive, but at least I know why. You know, I've, I've, that's the thing with beautiful plumbing. We we really try um, wherever we can is to follow the Australian standards, especially the gas standards, because it's very important for your safety and um, stuff like that. So anyway, get what you pay for. So be aware. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. Catch you later.